really early. I'm sure I look like a disaster. Good morning everyone. Welcome to another video on the green olive. Today I am going to do what I eat in a day and I really don't normally get that hungry early in the morning. I sip on green tea and water. This morning I am having a green juice. So again, I'm having trouble speaking this morning. It's my go-to, it really is my favorite, and it just makes me feel so good. Lunchtime, leftover style. I am all about using leftovers today. I've got leftover rice, I've got peas, corn, tofu. So I am gonna put it all in a pan, one pot, super easy, super quick, and I'm gonna have lunch. Everything's ready to go. This is gonna be super simple. I've got my leftover rice. I've got half a cup each of corn and peas. They're frozen. I have like three ounces of tofu, pressed. Um, liquid aminos, sorry liquid aminos, just because I actually prefer the taste to soy. Salt, pepper, no salt, already got the salt. And I'm too lazy to cut up garlic and onion today, so just garlic and onion powder. We're gonna start it off with a teaspoon of sesame oil. This is one pot, one easy lunch, under 10 minutes. I am also going to add a nori sheet. I had one left and it was like destroyed. So I'm just going to kind of tear this up and throw it in. You could add sesame seeds in here, that would be really good. And of course, I don't even know what life would be like without kimchi. Mmm! Come on now. Here you go, guys. It's my lunch. You know it's gonna be good. Oh yeah. Little kimchi, tofu. Awesome. I'm gonna go enjoy this. I'll see you at dinner. Hey, it is dinner time and Jerry and Jay are having one of their favorites, fettuccine alfredo. So I am going to have the same, but I'm gonna veganize it. So I got everything that I need all laid out. I'm doing uh, cashew cream as the base. However, cashews can be wicked high in fat, so I'm using just a quarter cup 
under 200 calories and I'm gonna um, do some other things. So this is gonna like complement the Alfredo. So first things first, in here I have the cashews, water, and lemon juice. Just gonna blend it up. So for the next part, I am using portobello mushrooms. I'm gonna put spinach in there, um, but let me show you how I make the sauce. Portobello's, thyme, garlic, shallot, nutritional yeast, a little bit of white wine, some parsley, spinach. Spicing things up a bit and using the chili oil as the base that I made last week. version looks so good. I think Jerry's jealous. Are you? Uh, Are you? It smells wicked good and it, it <laughs> does look good. I got portobello mushroom sauteing and some white wine, a little bit of vegetable broth, shallots, garlic. What's he got? She might have outdone me with her kick-ass recipe up against my jarred sauce and burnt chicken. When the pasta is closer to being finished, I will finish this sauce. if the pasta is done. Ooh, hot. <laughs> I'm gonna add pasta water. Loosen it up. Look how good. I don't know what I'll call it. Creamy mushroom pasta? I can't even get at it. I bet it's good. It looks so good. The sauce is killer too. Is it good? It is good. Thanks for watching the What I Ate in a Day video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you like it, hit the like button, subscribe, and tell your friends. Have a good day. Ciao.